My name's Keir Harder. I am 24 years old. I've been running Skate Yourself now for about five years, six years. Uh, Skate Yourself is a skateboard company looking to make a, a positive change in the community through the use of skateboarding. We pull up, we get all the equipment out, we set two people off in the park to, to skate with them, to get to know them, to build the rapport and just make sure that they're okay. And then two people will walk around Hebden Bridge. Um, it's quite a large town, so walk around all the side streets, meet every single one of them and bring them back to the park. I'm Julie Smith, um, I work for Yorkshire Sport Foundation. We know from experience, you know, when, when people are physically active, yes, they're healthier, but typically they're happier, typically they're, um, they feel a belonging to different groups, they, they're involved in more social groups, they're happier. There's so many benefits of being active, and that's where Yorkshire Sport aligns so beautifully with Active Carl Dodell's work. I was introduced to Keir Hardy, who then started Skate It Yourself. He was a young guy himself, and he was so passionate about letting kids have a go at this skateboarding thing that he was passionate about. And again, as the story started to come out, the way that the, the young people were developing, becoming volunteers, becoming more active, you know, parents were having a go at this thing as well, and it was just a beautiful thing. And then we had some funding available, and ha having seen the benefits that Dan and Keir Hardy were finding, we just said, well, Active Card, Yorkshire Sport, Skate It Yourself, can all come together and, and work really, really well together cohesively. We've got a lot of funding from Yorkshire Sport Foundation, especially on this project specifically, this was the biggest one. Um, it really helped out when the Yorkshire Sport Foundation kicked in and Active Coldale, it suddenly could be weekly and that's necessary with work like this. If you skip a week, they know you're, they, they don't, that, that rapport doesn't build that week, it actually declines. Um, so that's they've really helped and it actually makes the project worthwhile doing. Um, so yeah, they really saved the project step. My name is Ollie and I'm eight. I got sponsored by SIY, Skate It Yourself. I enjoy that you can just go any trick once you learn to go down ramps, like can go anywhere you want and crawls. We've met teens that, you know, when we met them, they're doing drugs, they're, doing, they're, they're excessively drinking, they're doing antisocial behaviour by definition and getting in trouble with the police a lot. You know, there's people that have started and actually started volunteering with us now who before were the people getting in trouble with the police and things like that and now they take an actual role in the company. I was dressing in tracksuits, wearing my man bag, looking all swag with my, my weed in my bag and stuff like that. I was smoking weed, getting in trouble with the police and stuff, so massive impact for me. I, I'm more energetic now, I'm more happy. It helps me a lot, but for other people to see what I'm doing, it kind of, it's inspiring. They can be like, whoa, I can do that, so why not? I was a little bit frightened about being out and about on a park with you know, boys drinking and swearing and all that business, but Skate It Yourself just made it different. It's like it becomes like a community, you're almost like a family with them. They make you feel really safe and, and part of something which is nice as well. My name's Jamie Wilson. Uh, my son Seth Hendricks Wilson is a skateboarder. He's sponsored by Skate It Yourself. Uh, we, we feel that skateboarding is very good at sort of overcoming fear uh, and sort of dealing with stressful situations. That's certainly something that's really important for us as parents to try and instill in Seth. Um, skateboarding definitely gives us that. Confidence has really, really come on. Um, she's more outgoing now and um, just a well-being of, you know, socialising and, yeah, getting over a fear of big crowds, I guess. For me, a massive message to any, anybody else is just have a go at something that's a bit different. Funding football and cricket and netball great for the kids and the young people that want to do a team sport but there's so many young people that don't something like this is is incredible i say the the outcomes community outcomes like cohesion um, the happiness of these young people they now go, go to school whereas quite a few of them weren't weren't attending school that self-confidence that teamwork all of those amazing life skills they come from something like skateboarding as much as you know a classic sports um club and environment so have a go try something different if you get you know, anywhere near the outcomes that we've had, jobs are good done. So how does it make you feel? Happy, excited and free. Get on a board, put your helmet on. I'll teach you how to skate. That's it. All you have to do is stand on the board and you're away. Practice makes perfect. <laughs>